What is up teachers on fire? Today I want to show you how to use a new feature in Canva that is not getting enough love and that is the video background remover. Now there are so many different ways you can use this feature and your students can use this feature but I'm going to show you how to make a fun middle school announcement. All right here we go let's get started. Our first stop is in canva.com. Hopefully you have a Canva for Education account. It's free to gain one. You just need to apply for one through Canva. Next, we're going to go down here to video and create blank. Video and create blank. So we want to start with this beautiful blank canvas. And over here on the left side, you should see the uploads button, the uploads button. We're going to hit the uploads button. I'm just going to cut the tape for a moment because uploads is normally going to open in the image tab. And I don't want you to be able to see the images of my students. All right, so we've selected uploads and you've selected the videos tab. That's where I am now. And I'm going to bring in a video that I shot on my phone using nothing but my phone, no microphone or special equipment, just my phone. And this is an announcement, it's going to autoplay here, so let me just silence myself. And this is going to be an announcement for my middle school, as I said. So I'm, I'm sort of fictionalizing a beach day coming up in January. That's going to be something that we can really get behind when the weather is cold and rainy. What I'm going to do right now is trim off the ends of my video, and I can kind of tell where my video starts. Usually I sort of uh, give a, a bit of a celebratory clap to get things started. Let's see if I have it right. Okay, not bad. So I'm showing you this part of the process because if you haven't edited your video anywhere else, you probably have something like this, especially if you shot it yourself. If you have someone else shoot it for you, maybe you, uh, maybe you don't have a whole lot on the beginning or end. That you need to trim off and I think that looks right so maybe what I will do is I'll just drag the marker here and play from this point okay so that is my video I'm pretty happy with the announcement I'm going to move it over to the corner and the next thing I'm going to do is edit video edit video right up here and over here is this wonderful feature called background remover so let's click that now this is a cloud-based platform and the tool is going to be running from the Canva servers. And normally it's going to take a whole lot more time than that, but I've done it a couple of times and I guess it just remembers the work. So there we go. It is done for us. Normally it will take a, a few minutes to get there. The next step that I want to take is to put a beautiful beach behind me, a beautiful beach behind me. So. Over here on the left menu tab, and I wonder, Canva, if we could color code these buttons or make them stand out just a little bit more, but we're going to click videos, and we're going to type in beach. Beach, now we've got tons and tons of great options. Let me zoom in on these great options here. Lots of awesome options. Something I'm going to be looking for is a frame that remains basically still. I don't necessarily want a drone shot or something moving all over the place because that's going to create kind of a nauseating effect. But if it's a still frame, that looks like a still frame, although it's, the sun isn't quite as inviting as I would like. Maybe this kind of a video. Oh, it's moving around a little bit too. Okay, I think I saw one up here that might work. Okay, so this is a still frame. I'm going to zoom in and then select this, or pardon me, zoom out and then select this video. Now this video is going to be my background. So before I stretch it out, I wanna hit position and let's send it backward. And then we're going to drag it up like so. And folks, we are almost done. This is too easy here. I'm going to move myself over here and let's see what we've got. Just wanna get rid of that square there, okay. Now it's too bad that my it's too bad that my chair is a little bit visible behind me. You could easily get rid of that yourself by just recording yourself standing up in another setting. But just before we go, let's add some graphics, shall we? So we can do something like this, and uh, we'll we'll call it uh, Beach Day. 
day and we can change those colors make them pop a little bit so we can go with white and we can go with white again beach day okay i like that lots of different things you can do of course with these letters if you know the canva tips and tricks let's see what it looks like if we make that neon nope that's crazy town that is crazy town control z that and then we need a date so we can add that pretty quickly by selecting uh what did i select subheading and i can put january the 10th and this is the kind of announcement that i can throw up on my uh, tv monitors around the middle school or you can also add to the lms and maybe you want to change the font a little bit to something more exciting or interesting january the 10th and then if you want to add a bit of a button behind that text you can even do something like that it's oh it's why isn't that dragging there we go and just slide it there sort of do some resizing and it should allow me to select a color that fits with now normally it will give me a color that is a good match maybe i'll stick with that and let's see here and there we go i i like this setup there's more of course that we could add but that was pretty fast the one advantage I had was that you weren't able to see the background removal take place in its full length. It's normally about two or three minutes, but there you go. Uh, one more step I suppose we should demonstrate is how to save this, how to download it. So hit share and then download. And then I would recommend saving. In fact, it's really the only option you have in terms of video format. You don't want to select GIF that will get rid of the sound. So select as select the MP4 and we will download as such. We'll hit download. Now notice again, this, uh, this is back to the, the bit of the delay that we have to face when we're dealing with rich video content. It will take some time, but that MP4 will download to our computer and or our Google Drive if you're using a Chromebook. And now we can use it wherever we want in Google Slides or uh, in other any other place. Uh, throw it up to YouTube or whatever you want. So. There you have it, folks. That is how you go about removing the background from a video and uh, just one idea of some of the fun ways that you can use that technique. All right, until next time, take care and keep teaching on fire. What is happening, middle schoolers? It's Mr. KV, and I wanna let you know that on Tuesday, January the 10th, we're gonna get rid of all this cold and rain, and we're going to enjoy beach day. That's right, come in your favorite beach wear. Keep it appropriate, keep it appropriate, but come in your beach wear, and let's just uh, break out the flip-flops, the shorts, the tank tops, and the t-shirts, the sunglasses, the lays, whatever you've got in your closet. And we're just going to pretend for a moment that it's warm outside and we're by the ocean. So Tuesday, January the 10th, come ready for beach day.